Lakini ukienda kwenye streams za music especially yep. kwenye upande wa mauzo ya album zama jinsi watu ambao wanasikiliza muziki kwenye album ya mwezi uliopita hii ripoti wage inatoka mara moja kwa mwezi uh, ya boom play album namba moja ilikuwa ni ya kwako wa monize ya made for us uh, namba mbili ilikuwa ni timeless ya davido namba tatu ilikuwa ni kani ya mboso namba nne ilikuwa ni formula, formula seven ya fali pupa mm. love sounds different ya barnaba ilikuwa na fasi ya tano alafu high school tena ya kwako ilikuwa kwenye na fasi ya sita mm. Uh, kwa maana hiyo watu bado wanapenda kusikiliza. Yaani okay. wana, wanapenda kusikiliza mziki ambao unaweka kwenye album zako. Yeah. Unatuaidi nini kwenye visit bongo ambayo inatoka kesho kutwa? Uh, kwanza tu niwashukuru watu wote ambao walikuwa wakiniunga mkono na kunisikiliza. Na ndio maana kuniuliza una strategy gani? Mimi nakwambia have a zero strategy kwa sababu hata tunatoa made for us kufanya press conference kufanya hata at least hata nimefanya interview hapa imegongana na mambo ya tuzo ndio that ndio ni code of XSL lakini mimi na believe kwenye ku create kile kitu ambacho na create kina askizi mtu akisimchoshe maskioni hiyo uh, anajivunia sana na nawashukuru ndio kwa support ninalipa nguvu na mad for us tangu itoke sasa hivi ni mwaka ile kutoka namba moja iko namba moja siku zote mm. then tangu itoke siku imetoka mm. Pop, ndio hapo kwenye top uh, top album za hiyo kuwa na mbili au na matatu nilikuwa na mmoja mpaka leo nikabia kuacha album nyingine na nyingine tena kwa hiyo you can see creative uh, cre- ukiwa creative ni kiasi gani ina faida uh, unajua kuna nyimbo zinasikiliza afu kuna nyimbo unaweza kupita club ukakuta inapigwa afu kuna da nyimbo yangu imeite lakini sio nyimbo ambayo mzee anakaa nyumbani akawa anasikiliza au akawa na drive anasikiliza hata hata sikiliza tu akiwa pale club kitoka pale so mimi ambao mtu anaweza akakaa sema i want to listen to music afa mm. play kwa hicho kitu kina to confuse pia wasanii mimi mwingine sio kitu kibaya kuwaza kwamba hata kama nitengeneza nyimbo fulani ili club hiyo inapigwa uh, kuwa na hiyo vision sio kitu kibaya lakini mimi most of the time naangalia kwamba ni create wimbo ambao mtu anaweza kusikiliza popote anaweza kusikiliza anaweza kaenda club pia ka vibe nao lakini ukiacha mambo ya club anaweza kukaa nyumbani kama yuko sad akasikiliza sad song kama yuko broken heart akasikiliza kama yuko happy in love akasikiliza hicho ndicho kifanya kwa hiyo niwashukuru na niwaahidi tu kwamba uh, the next album so one of album i have heard so yeah visit bongo eh yeah, go yeah. um one time mm-hmm. wakati kanye west umeona yuko zake Saudi Arabia eh, anatengeneza mm-hmm. album yake wewe mm-hmm. unatengeneza album unakuwa gani <laughs> yaani mazingira gani anafaa kutulia wewe kutengeneza hawe eh asa bwana kuna kitu ambacho nilikuwa nakichukulia serious sana kwenye maisha yangu kuna kitu ambacho nilikuwa nakichukulia sana kama mpira alafu nilikuwa na this is not for me after music came kwa hiyo mimi muziki bwana ni kitu ambacho naimba najiimba tu maisha yangu ukiniumiza nitakuimba utaniuta nitakuimba paka wewe utakuwa shabiki wewe nyimbo because it's just something kind of me kwa si 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 angalie nitengeneze nyimbo nikiwa kwenye mazingira gani sije kwenda sio kusema naweka kambi nenda sasa nifanye kutunza wimbo ah yeah. what happened in my life is some music kwa sababu mimi ni muziki ni maisha yangu yeah. kwao nikiwa na good mood nikiamka i'm happy feel like i want to make a music and i make a hip hop song mm. nikiwa niko sad that's it yeah yani mimi niko hivyo yeah. Niki, nikiamua kujisifia hivyo <laughs> nikiamua <laughs> 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 yeah. nikiona kabisa i think i want to inspire by the way kuna album yangu kuna nyimbo inaitwa hallelujah mm. Kuna siku asubuhi ilikuwa ni Ijumaa. Sasa Zuri Jumaa mama yake anampeleka ana msikitini. Mm-hmm. Kwa hiyo nimeamka na nikawa nampigia sana simu ni mkubwa wake bwana nataka niongea na mtoto. Anajibu bwana ah Zuri adudi msikitini. Adudi <laughs> msikitini bado leo anaambia msikitini. And you can touch him kasema kwa mwanangu anajua kabisa okay it's a Friday she has to go to the masjid. Afrika anaita kwa ni mimi nipite na kama miezi miwili mitatu yani sikumbuka yani siku ambazo nimeenda msikitini kwa nyoo mwaka zinahesabika mm. lakini Mwenyezi Mungu bado ananithamini bado ananipa riziki bado anapunua bado ananiongeza anipa value umeona mm. kwa hiyo nikasema sawa inaweza send him sikitia siku but i have to make a song to give thanks to the source create life mm. which is god mm. tunaimbia vitu vingi lakini mambo mengine lazima tukumbuke kwamba kuna Mungu pia ambaye tunamkosea sana ambaye hatutii kwa sababu tuliumbwa kuja ku, 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 uh, kumsalia yeye si ndio 
kuomba kuomba maghfirah la Kiislamu tunajaga hivyo kuomba msamaha na vitu kama hivyo ama tuna sala tano lakini pia wakristo ndugu zangu wanaenda pia kanisa ni ndio that lakini tunajisahau mambo yanakuwa ni mengi kuchanganya ujana tu tunajisahau lakini pia bado natupa riski bado pia natu tufanye kama kwa tunapumua kwa hiyo basi tukiacha msikitini hata kwenye huu muziki ambao unaopenda do something kwa hiyo you can inspire me for my kid my daughter so you can find katengeza wimbo unaitwa haleluya ambao ndio kumshukuru Mwenyezi Mungu nice are you still single for sure for real love me for speech ya mdada fulani if you kwenye insta story watu wananiuliza kama umerudi kwenye mahusiano tena kwamba mrembo fulani hivi watu wanahisi ni girlfriend wako amna sikuposa mejiposti mwenyewe amechukua simu yako akajipost ni nani wewe sasa sasa si alikuwa na simu yako mimi sijui sijamuona unajua ana kulikuwa ni party kwa hiyo watoto walikuwa ni wingi sana pale mbo gani kwa mmoja atafariki kupata simu yako na password juu eh unajua mimi ni kobo sana leo mtu akiwa rafiki yangu ni kobo na ushkaji ndio zile kwenye story story sasa sijui nimekuaje kwa sababu vipi nimeripost mtu kapost mimi nimeripost mimi kokoaje mbona siri kwa kabidi fute sawa mimi kokoaje kwa mtu kaje nyaka photo selfie hizi nyaka photo haya maneno matatu anyways speaking of that ni mshikaji wangu ni mwanangu rafiki yako yeah of course kama always kuficha nikae ni simba she she my friend tumefanya video ya single again in order to lakini sikupost nyinyi kikweli yeye amejiposti siwezi kusema mungu na sikuta sikuta kuposti kwa sababu mimi naupa sana mziki wangu sasa attention kuliko mambo ya mahusiano. Huta nisikia mimi nakwambia so I'm in love ndio bana hiyo vitu ni shabu. Wewe juzi tu hapa uko hiyo in love story nyingi sana. Ni shabu kwa huko hizo. Okay my goals now ni to chase money goals don't chase me. Yeah okay. Huta nisikia mimi nakwambia huyu anampenda ana na maisha acha ana shaka mtu mzima ama mimi ya zamani tena. Sawa maneno kwa hiyo wewe ziona mimi namposti mwanangu kesho. Na visit bongo. Kutukaribisha kwenye visit bongo ambayo inatoka this week. Eh. Three words. Real quick. Let's go. So you can sign up. Uh, kwanza kama title unavyosema visit bongo. Mm. Um, it's a room, it's a book. Mm. It's a tourism in a music. Itakupa yeah. ule ile vision ya bongo forever. Okay. Kwa kwa uwezo wangu nimejitahidi ku create hivyo. So niombe tu uh, my patience ubaki siku tatu, 3 days to go. Album ni nzuri sana. Nimejitahidi kwa uwezo wangu. Lakini pia nataka ni give thanks to um, B-boy uh, kama Um, co director co uh, co producer and ame amekuwa ki engineer uh, of course nimekuwa na producer tofauti tofauti lakini one is come to arrange hapa iwe hivi fanye hivi mm-hmm. bibo amekuwa kisimamia day one lakini bibo pia amesimamia high school lakini bibo pia ndo amesimamia uh, made for us nyimbo nyingi kwenye made for us nyimbo nyingi kwenye high school bibo ndo amesimamia so shout out to my brother bibo uh, ni mdogo wangu ni my brother na i love him so much so shout out to him lakini pia producers wote uh, lakini pia wengine ambao wana sound engineer kama Enkiz Morento amehusika kwa mix nyimbo nyingi sana lakini pia kuna DJ Tariko amehusika kwa nyimbo tofauti tofauti lakini pia my team kwa the gangs management watu wangu wa karibu unajua watu wa karibu ndo wanakupa vision mm-hmm. yeah. ukiimba madudu watu wa karibu wakusifia tunaona <laughs> kama yes kumbe nimeua ndio <laughs> madudu kwa nimeshukuru sana watu wangu wa karibu mara zote wamekuwa kinambia yes this is right this is not kwa uh, thanks to the gang family Samcho Pole Zara Boy mbona bwana Jengo Tam sio kina Kitonga Thomas na everybody in the gang mbona bwana yes ni wanangu na tuna we make a music life kwa hiyo ni mashabiki pia za mwisho naombe tumwe uh, na washukuru sana na ni support lakini pia niombe tumwe tayari the album is coming out on friday na we did this for the bongo forever baby yeah thank you asante kwa kusikiliza double xl we out